Hello there, this is Rom Wills coming back at you with yet another video. Communication creates connections with women. And I'm gonna tell you what, I talked about connection in my last video, but it's very important to understand to even get to that point of connecting. You gotta communicate, you can't get around that. You, you can't get around that. You know, and I've talked about this before on different levels. I remember I did a video talking about you have to engage women. Hey, a lot of guys get on there complain. Oh, you've never heard of me too and all of that. Dude, I'm out in the streets. I'm out in the world most and mo more than most people who are gonna have any criticisms or whatever, gonna say whatever. But is that gonna stop you? You still gotta communicate. If you still, if you want a woman, you still got to communicate. Now, let me talk about that thing, that whole me too thing. You got to learn not to harass a woman. That's just it, okay? If a woman ain't showing interest, you don't force it. Use some common sense. But you still got to communicate. You still got to talk. I'm going to tell you what, coming up, didn't have like social media, didn't have videos it's, and everything. We, you had to learn it out in the streets. And when I say out in the streets, you had to go outside. You had older men, boys, whoever, who would actually tell you, go talk to that woman, go talk. You still gotta talk. Now, no matter what your, like I said in the last episode, no matter what your bait is, I don't care what your bait is, you still gotta talk. There's plenty of guys who will say, hey, Rob, I'm hitting the gym, I'm handsome, I'm this but they won't talk to the women, which I think is going to happen. You think they just going to magically come up to you because they think you so handsome. And even then when they coming up to you, they talking, you got to say something back. They are not just going to grab you and do everything and be in a relationship with you. You got to talk to them. You got to communicate. One of the things free game that I get very free. I say, go out and say hi to three women a day, random women, regardless of their interaction. The whole point of the exercise is to build that muscle within you, psychological muscle within you, to be able to comfortably talk with women. Because you'll start off, if you keep doing it every day, you'll start off saying hi, but then after a while, you'll be to the point you can have small talk. You can have small talk with that woman. Now I know there's some guys out there say, no, I just want the sex and sex, I want the sex. Uh, you gotta put a foundation down before you can get there. You can't walk up to a total stranger and just say, hey, I want to fuck. Now, I know some people say, hey, that's possible, but in most cases, it's not. Most cases, it's not. It's going to be very, very, very rare. Or you have to be really skilled. And even then, you still got to communicate that too. So you have to communicate. And see, that's the important thing, because as I said yesterday, Relationships relate. Y'all gotta talk with each other. Like I use the example of being naked, butt naked in a room with a woman and y'all not having sex. You gotta communicate. Now, people say, well, how to do that? What book to read? It's like, no, I'm gonna tell you something now. Coming up, we didn't have books on that. Yeah, they got some books on communication and everything. But trust me, trust me, trust me. You can read all the books you want. You can watch all the videos you want. But then that woman that you meet, she is gonna be something totally different because here's the thing. Say you're meeting women in the streets. You can't say, you can't use a cookie cutter approach. I mean, other than saying, hi. Huh? And even then it's depending on the situation. It's gonna be, okay, what, what area are you in? What's the environment? What's going on? You gotta be able to flow with it. It could be anything. Y'all might get a conversation over, you know what, I remember I was in a, a local grocery store. I had a con long conversation with a woman. We were talking about handmade soaps. And you know, anybody who knows me, anyone who knows me, they know that's what, uh, that's what I'm about. Shoot, I love, I love natural soaps. So me and her were just talking. We both like the same thing. See, and that's another part of communication. When you do communicate, you got to have something in common because usually when people communicate, they're looking for a common thing, like out in public. You might see somebody. What's one of the main things people will say? Oh, this is some jacked up weather. <laughs> I mean, that's, that's a common thing. Y'all both experiencing that. And then you can just flow from there. 
you can flow from there. Or even if you see somebody you think they're real attractive, you go up and say, hey, how you doing? You know what, I think you're real attractive. You know, that's still communication. But you gotta create that, you gotta have that to meet them, but then also to keep a relationship going. Like I always say, you got a lot of guys saying, well, it's just money, it's just money, it's just money. Well, first of all, they typically not gonna know how much money you have, you know? Unless you walking around like with a bunch of chains on or, you know, diamond encrusted watches, all of that, even then, it don't mean you have money. They not gonna know. And unless they recognize you from social media or something, which most, most men ain't gonna have, status, they ain't gonna see that. And even if you wanna bring that in, you gotta communicate. You gotta talk to them. You know, if for the, even for the guys that think, oh, it's just looks, 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 looks. Okay, what you always say? Women will say a guy looks good until he opens his mouth. You still gotta communicate. That opens the door. Communication is opening the door for other stuff, for a possibility. And especially, okay, maybe your bait isn't as strong. That communication can take you a long way. Now, some people will call it a mouthpiece, but honestly, you can get a woman hot just off a regular conversation. Because one thing with women, they look for that connection. They look for that emotional connection. You know what, instead of trying, you know, and I've talked several times about a woman's lust, that's one thing. And you know, some other guys trying to hit them on a logical level and stuff, eh, that's so-so. Usually with gold diggers or somebody like that who's looking to use you. But if you can hit a woman's heart, see that communication can open a heart. All of a sudden, y'all talking about something similar. You are talking about something she likes. And here's some game with that. It, and this is something in general. Find out what she likes. Like if she mentions she's interested in something, butterfly collection, collecting. And you, you don't care about butterflies, but just say, oh, what's that like? What's that about? You know, whatever, whatever she talks about, whatever she might have expertise in, but you communicating. And also part of communicating is just listening to what she's saying and responding. You could have a whole, you could have a long conversation with the woman, right? Like you could have an hour long conversation. She can, after y'all finish the conversation, she go back to her girlfriend and say, yo, Yo, girls, I was, dang, I was talking with this guy, oh, it was just great. You go back to the fellas, you say, you know what, all I say was, mm-hmm, yeah, wow. <laughs> but you're communicating. Part of communicating is listening. But mainly, it's still the back and forth. And the only way you can truly develop it, yeah, you can watch this video, you can watch a, you can watch a thousand videos. You can read a thousand books, literally. And still you're gonna come across something that wasn't covered in none of those mediums. <laughs> but that's why I say the only way to do it is really just go out. Start off with the talk, saying hi to three women a day. Get to the point you're comfortable. When you're in line at a grocery store or uh, someplace where there's a clerk, let's say throw in a little extra, hey, have a nice day, something like that. That's why I know so many clerks in the area. You at a restaurant, you have a nice young lady being a server, say something, you know, nice or thank you. You'd be surprised just saying thank you, acknowledging her or something like that could take you a long way. Just being polite, you know, saying something like, you know, you did a great job. Thank you. I appreciate you. And boom. It can lead to so much more, but it all, all of it comes down to communication. All right. All of it comes down to communication. So anyway. That's all I have for right now. Get out there and open that mouth and talk. All right. Anyway, I get back with y'all. Peace and blessings.